What's the most, uh, if you don't mind, the most like outlandish thing you've heard from a voter? That I arranged to have a street ripped up on election day, so there was a detour, a block, one block detour to her polling place, and I arranged for that so she couldn't go vote. Tracy Farron is one of Wisconsin's 1,850 municipal clerks and 72 county clerks who manage polling places, hire poll workers, and abide by election laws enforced by the Wisconsin Elections Commission. Across the state and nation, election clerks have been facing unprecedented scrutiny since the 2020 elections. You know, I, I think the misinformation is still out there, obviously. Um, but I try to kind of explain our checks and balances to people. They bring up an issue to me. And first, I like to get to the source of it. If they say that they have heard this, how did you hear it? Where did you hear it? Because you saw it written somewhere doesn't mean that's exactly gospel. So, In Wisconsin, the bulk of the scrutiny and threats has been directed at the Wisconsin Elections Commission and officials in Milwaukee and Madison and to a lesser extent, Racine, Green Bay, and Kenosha. But even in outstate Wisconsin, where Trump won by a fair margin or didn't lose by much, some clerks are feeling the heat. I mean, I, there's always gonna be a skeptic and I'm totally fine with that. But um, the numbers are the numbers. At the end of the day, uh, we have a very secure system. I'm super confident in it and I'm sorry if the outcome wasn't to someone's liking, that doesn't invalidate our whole system.